What is up everyone? Today we have a brand new news post and a brand new track for gold members but soon to be everybody. So today I'm going to be going over both the news post and doing a few races on this new track. I'll hop right into it. So starting today, Nitro Gold subscribers get exclusive early access to the news track in Nitro, Nitro City. So yes, the track is called Nitro City. Uh, then they go into some detail about the track itself. I won't read it out loud, but if you want to read this, uh, it looks like they describe it pretty well, but we'll talk about the details. Uh, it's on the test website for Nitro Gold members. And then it says, this brand new street racing environment debuts today on test.nitrotype.com for gold members, uh, but will be available for all players on November 20th, 2021. Uh, it says that Nitro City is the fourth track, following, uh, I believe, Seaside Rally, Heritage Trail, and then the normal one. And then, let's see what uh, they talk about down here. Every track in Nitro Ship is a uniquely stylized racing experience, and Nitro City is no different. Nitro City is a neon-soaked metropolis. Probably said that wrong. Actually, I don't think I did. Where cars are more than just vehicles, they're prized possessions that demand attention. Cars are realistically lit overhead streetlights and roving spot is that even the i feel like i'm reading all these wrong roving spotlights illuminate the finish line nitro city is perfect for those who drive one of nitro's flashier vehicles or equip bright trails because anything flashy deserves its own limelight right so uh i think that's what we're gonna do i believe um that is pretty much what they talk about yeah then they talk about gold and then like the community and stuff like that but that is the main point of this video i am super excited we are about to hop onto it i'm gonna quickly check the shop though to see if i have it. oh i don't have this car sweet 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 okay okay that's actually really cool um but anyways let's hop into actually racing on the track though all right so we are currently on the test website now and we are going to be doing a few races on this brand new track wow oh wow this is absolutely amazing i can already tell all right let's do our first race okay so i'm gonna be honest that was a really bad race However, what we can do is we are going to quickly exit out of the results screen and we are going to take an in-depth look at what we have on the track. So firstly, they obviously did talk about the neon lights and the spotlights, which is what we see in like the finishing kind of touches of this. They really highlight the winners. They highlight the race finish line. They have these really cool like lights on it too. Uh, obviously, we see like the classic Nitro people from, the, I believe, the V3 update. And then we also have some pretty cool shops yeah, on this side. This is overall like a really cool track. I think one of the things that was kind of dangerous to making this kind of track is making it too flashy. And I think they really did a good job at like not over, uh, I guess, over exemplify. That's a wrong word, but like overly saturating the track, if that makes sense. Let's do another race. Okay, so obviously my typing is not amazing. I haven't typed in a little while. However, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be going back to this news page. And what I want to talk about is what they gave us at the front. So um, obviously we saw the finish line kind of with the track. However, we also got kind of an in-race track that we can look at. So obviously we see a similar thing to what we saw at the end. The track or uh, the track, sorry, the shops and the people and the lights and stuff like that. However, we also see that there are like intersections and other cars, which is really cool. I don't think we've seen like a lot of like actual cars other than like maybe one on the heritage shell track, but it's overall a really, really cool track. In my opinion, I would love to hear what you guys think. One other thing that I think is interesting is that they have this, um, kind of car that was never released but was supposed to be released in the nitro shop so i'm not sure what the plan is for that if that will ever be released however it's pretty interesting i hope you guys enjoy the track have an amazing day and peace out 